Hi, this is Matt. Um, I am going to show you how to create your first site on Triangulate. To get started, just go to the home page at triangulate.io uh, and click on the Get Started link. Uh, we're going to create a site on the hosted service. If you are a developer and want to create your own version of Triangulate, you can, and you can learn how to do that via the open source project link. But for today, we're just going to use the service built into to triangulate.io. So you click Get Started. I'm going to key in a site name. A username and password. And I'm going to select a theme. I'm going to start with the chromatic theme. This is the same theme that's used for triangulate.io. Um, and it gives you a nice starter theme for your site. And I'm going to just hit Create Site. Uh, triangulate will create your site in the background. I'm going to open it here in another tab so that you can see it. Um, so by default, your your site is created. It has a home page, a blog, an about page, and a contact uh, contact us page. Now I'm going to log in and show you how to edit some of these pages. So you can just log in with the login you provided when you created your site. And just to get started, I'm going to go to the About page and show you how to edit this page. Uh, Triangulate supports drag and drop for editing content. So, for example, if I wanted to just move this quote, quote up to the top of the page, I'll just drag it and move it there. Hit Save and Publish. And you will notice that after a refresh that the About page has been updated. Uh, changing the content is just as easy. So this is just a demo on how to change content. Um, you can change content, hit Save and Publish, and after you refresh the page, uh, the content's updated. Um, the entire application is drag and drop, so it's very simple to change information on the page. Uh, the next thing I'm going to show you is I'm just going to create a new page. So you, on the page, I'm in the Pages uh, folder, so I'm just going to hit up Add Page. And I am going to say this is just a test page. It'll automatically create a friendly URL for you. And after I add it, um, you can see it's not published, but I'm going to go into it. And this is a test page. I am going to publish it. So I'm going to hit Save and Publish. I could go and view the live page right away. Um, but what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to go into the menus. And I am going to add a menu item for that page. So just click Add Item. From the URL, you can select the page. As it's published, it will show up there. And we hit Add Menu Item. Just like the editor, this part's drag and drop. So I can just drag this around. And I'm going to move it under here. I'm going to hit Publish. And when we refresh the page, we'll see the new menu link. And we can go to the new page. So that's just a, a brief overview of creating pages and adding menu items within Triangulate. Um, look for more videos to come in the future showing you how to use the application. Thank you.